Hey, how goes it? We're gonna try to do something with this room. Um, I'm just kinda winging it as I have been. I need a lot of melee units in this room. Let's put a couple of these guys. Like this. Now that's intentional. Oh uh, no, I don't think I'm going to be able to get through that corner. Well, maybe. Let's find out. Let's just drop a... No. A snotter. There. Can I move you at all? I don't think I can. Nope. Different room. Oops, wrong one. This one. Yes. Alright, let's actually look in here and see if there's any rooms worth buying again. Um, I want I think we could use this one maybe. We already have the outdoor or the indoor one. Man, I just don't know. Hmm. No, I want to try this one. Is this the one? No, it is not. Let's try again. There is a room that I liked from the level 30 castle I attacked back in like level 10 or, or episode 10 or 12 or something. I don't know if it still exists. I think it may have been removed. I think it was originally this one. It was longer and skinnier. But I think it's only in that developer castle now. Let us see what options do we have. And this place has potential to be confusing as hell. You know, I'm curious. I want to try a thing. Um, I want to move this back over here. Oops, here, and rotate that around. Now, what I want to check is in here. How long do I have to get three stars? Uh, seven minutes and seventeen seconds. So if I leave. Because I don't know how the time is calculated anymore. I really don't. I thought I did, but I don't. Um, I'm going to just take a room. I'm going to rotate this. Okay, so that adds about 15 seconds. Even less. Like, not very long. Um... Leave castle, yes. Now, if I put a bunch of traps in here, what's it do? Inventory, traps. Does not matter what I put in here. Zoom in so I can do it. I was just checking to make sure all the traps have the same sized thing. Uh, if I put this one here, can I squeeze another one in somewhere? I don't think I can. I think that's the maximum I can fit in this room. Might have to put something else like this in there so I can fit like five. Uh, let's attack and see if traps increase the time in which they have. No, traps do not. Alright. Uh, we're going to do this. Leave castle, yes. We're going to have a delay room. It's not even going to have any monsters in it, really. I'm going to take this and put it all away. We're going to have a dick move, slow you down room. Its only purpose will be to take a long time to walk through. So, 
rooms. We need the longest, windiest ass room there is with possible multiple ways to go. Technically, I think this one would take the longest to get through. But, I'm uncertain of that. Let's check the rooms to buy. Um, let's see, what do we want? This could be good. These really do take a long time to get through. And we could stick with the outdoor theme of buying one of those. Um, we could do something similar to the first room again. I don't mind that. Hmm. We just want to make sure we can put a lot of traps in it. Check this thing out. And that is weird shaped. I've been in this room before many times, I remember it now. Uh, it is kind of direct either way you go. You know, I have an idea of what if I put a single mob here? Something that you wouldn't want to fuck with. Like, um, I don't know. It doesn't have to be big, just something that you can avoid intentionally put a monster that you can avoid and make them walk all the way around this way to avoid it. Hmm. Could be an interesting psychological trap and just put a fuckload of sticky mines. You know what, let's try it. I don't necessarily 100% like it, but I want to finish this castle. I've been playing this game way too long. I'm playing for about three hours straight here, and that's a long fucking time. Alright, what wouldn't you want to fuck with? Probably a Mega Mutton. Let's try this. I'm gonna take you, we're gonna rotate you around. Can't rotate you for whatever reason, we're gonna move you out. Now we're gonna rotate you. move you right into that hallway. Oh god, I could be a dick and put it back. Oh, I'm gonna be a dick. Alright, let's do this. Oh man, I'm a dick. It's so good though. And we need something to absorb the blow if something goes wrong. For six points, you can sit in front of him. How about that? Oh, yeah. That works just fine. We'll move you back one. Move you here. Spin you around. You can get killed in one hit. I don't care. I mean, I kind of do care, but... I don't care that much. Actually, you know what I might be able to do? Is that 20 points? Sure it is. Man, it's too bad I can't put him back here and have one more mob standing right next to him. I don't know if that's intentional balance, but it's definitely good balance that they've got going on there. Um, now traps. So if they pull that, that's good. They have to fight them then. But if they go around, it's even better. And I know you subscribers aren't going to fall for that because, well, you watched me build this castle. Uh, the only hope I have of ever stopping any of you guys is before these episodes go up because it will take a couple of days all right we can f play around with these a little um ooh stay there this Some mines might go in this room too, not these kind of mines, but the actual like gold digging mines. Just for the sake of minimizing the uh, explosive area. I think that still works. 
if you place a mine, it might make it so it takes, like, there's no chance of a mine spawning there, so it, you know, it just makes it work better, actually. Should I plant it from this side instead? Yeah, I'm gonna try planting it from this side, see if I can get a little bit more room. Okay, this guy can move a little bit. Alright, yeah, I might be able to squeeze more in this way. I can just... Yeah, maybe not. Maybe just get better coverage. I like that better. Uh, and I don't think I can get any more. Nah, no, there's no way. That's good, though. Um, we have a chunk more that we can, or a chunk more of uh, enemies that we can put, which means we can put some in here, but I would rather put them in here. Let's do that. Creatures. Uh, I was hoping I could drop some along there. I wonder, if I tucked a couple guys in here and made them almost like traps, like this. You don't have to fight these guys, but if during the boss fight you happen to walk too close to the walls, I need to put traps up here to force people to walk back. We're getting into the risky stuff, but with risks come some pretty awesome opportunities. Even if I don't like them. No. Okay, so I got eight points in each of these. Not enough points to make them both awesome, but I can maybe make them okay. Um, I'm going to have to get rid of these landmines, but we have a better idea now, so that's fine. Um, what else can we put in here to make this place really suck for anybody? Oh, I can't do that. Let's remove you. What we'll do is this. We'll put him here. And then we'll move some of these mines. Actually, it'd probably be better to put him on this side, but we'll do that in a second. Uh, we're gonna do... This. I would prefer for them to not go this way. So this might make them think they have to go this way. Might be a bit of a visual mental barrier. Um... Let's just do this for now. So we're going to put this guy up there in a second. Let's actually get rid of all of... Oops. No. Get rid of these. We're going to move you up in this corner. If someone wants to fight you, that's fine. You're going to go there. Now these mines need to move. Um, put you there, put you there, and this one's technically in an okay place for now. Alright, so, here are our traps, we will remove this, and remove that, and remove you. And I think that's all of them. We have a sticky trap there. Which I can technically move slightly. That will work beautifully. These are still connected, good. Now, we need traps over here to keep people from wanting to walk over here. That means fire traps. 
Um, we don't want you in this corner. Go the fuck away. Um, this might work. It's a big glowing orb. It'll make people not want to stand in it, hopefully. Uh, another fire trap would probably be better. Although this might be good, too. So if we do that... It'll pull from here, which means hopefully they'll run through and the boss fight won't happen in this circle. We want it to happen over here. Um, although at the same time, I can move this back and make sure that the fight happens here. Alright, we're going to do that. Oops, no. Everybody's got to move forward. We want the enemies... We, we want our enemy monster things to get closer. Get closer quicker. Actually, we just really want the Megamon to get closer quicker. Um, why is this saying collect? Go away. Alright, cool. This can go here. This can go here. And there. And kind of off to the side as well. Um, let's see if we can squeeze one trap here. And then another one in here somewhere, maybe? Mega Mutton is standing in the way of this trap, but that's okay. Um, I kind of wanted to put it here. If I do this another way, I can make it work. Let's remove this. Damn it. Okay. Um, this thing also has to move. Alright. Traps. Uh, we need to buy a new one. New fire trap. Buy. Here. I'm gonna have to move that guy, I think? No, that's fine, actually. Alright, so let's have a look at this. Go away. Collect these. So, this is technically a safe zone, quote-unquote. Um, the rest of this looks scary. It'll make you take a little bit of damage, and it might even be enough to really kill somebody, if we're lucky. Um, this would be a second mini-boss, essentially. Um, and we have a few points left, so we can really beef that up even more. Let's put... a healer in this group. We have five points left. How did that even happen? Got two points put in here. Uh, what can I do for two points? I feel like these are a waste. I like I should get rid of them and put something else in. Uh, how many points we got? Twelve? I can get some good stuff for twelve points. Um... Stairmaster. Jimbo's 12 points. He's pretty good. He hits like a freaking Mack truck. Uh, and if you're distracted by other things, he could be really, really useful. Uh, and we're gonna, let's see, Powerful Strike. We don't want him to do that at all. Uh, shield himself from damage. This could be probably the best thing. Yeah, that'll work. So, got this, got that. He's going to do what I want him to. This guy can be moved back a little bit. You can also be moved back here. If you're linked to him already, that should work. Yeah, let's just try that. That'll work. Um, this area feels intimidating. I'm hoping that I can just make stuff work there. Um, I can also maybe put 
three points of something over here just to be a dick. Uh, where else can I put more points? I can actually put three more points into this group, which is actually kind of good. This group is a little bit weak. Uh, it could use a healer. Uh, and I don't know if I don't know about the Zeke. He may not last. Uh, I might replace him. But uh, there's a few things I could put in here for three points. To help flush things out. You know, we'll give you a second shot, little stab of assassin thing. The sounds you make are glorious. All right, so um. Do I want to bother spinning everybody around here? Not really. Alright. This is going to be a kind of long episode, I think. I don't know, I forget what time I started. Um, I'm going to test the castle. It's probably going to go horribly. And then when I'm done playing, I'm going to fix my goddamn hotkeys. Uh, wait a second. At the same time, I want to test something. Um, oh, first off... Go here real quick. I want to check my inventory. Do I have anything good? What are all these pieces of crap? No. Whoop, wrong button. Pressing Path of Exile buttons again. No, uh, less health. Less health, better stuff. Less damage, increased attack speed. More armor. Eh. Again, a lot of health. I think this is the one I swapped out for last time. Damage reflect, magic armor. Mm. And you are not really that good either. What's it called? Zeke's shank. It's not a shank. Whatever. Um, what type of crossbow is this? I wish they would tell you if it was a repeater or whatever. Let's just put it on and see. It's a big bolty one. This is what I previously had, I don't remember. Whatever. It's been a while. Let's go back to the castle and attack ourselves. I think I should probably be ending this episode right around here, but I don't remember, so I'm just gonna keep going. Ah, uh, damn it, I forgot another thing. Don't worry guys, I'm totally professional. Actually, I don't get paid for this, so yeah. Let's change up some stuff. Uh, I can't see my skills. Go home. I want to try... Spiral Shot in place of Roll and try and get better at it. So, it's the opposite direction I'm aiming, right? Uh, I need to check that. Um, is there anything worth doing here? Dive is supposed to be pretty good still. Sentry's not so bad if I drop it on something that's stunned. How long does this work? Uh, it doesn't tell me. Yeah, we'll just do that. I gotta try this thing out before I go in there, so... If I walk over here... Oop, uh, my finger's in the wrong spot. Okay. I didn't push it twice, but that's cool. So it is backwards. And it does some damage, so that's good. Do you see that jump? And he stepped right on the thing and it didn't actually do anything. Alright, healers. Nah, I'm still silenced. Ah, freaking silence. This is not easy. Eh. Yeah. 
Okay, I got that off at least. Let's go over here. No, stop. Damn it. Man, you are annoying as shit. I'm glad I put a bunch of you guys in here. And he still got off that last one. There. Alright, first room did a pretty good job. Alright, I just realized I... Oop. Alright, I need to stun you, but I, I'm stunned myself. I gotta re remember to use my bear traps more. Because I don't use them enough. Alright, there we go. Alright, so I need to move that because that guy is not in the best place. That guy died in one hit, which is not as good as I was hoping for. Oh, he floated right over that. That's cool. Alright, there are better ways to do this room, that's for sure. And this is way more annoying than I thought it would be. Look at this. You kind of have to rush into this. You need to die immediately. Ah, this feels not dissipating fast enough. This way. No, move away. Come on, walk on top of this. Okay, let's pop a potion. Oh god, I forgot about that guy. I need to be not here, but I'm stuck. Uh, well, that didn't work out. I need my bear traps back. This is not a good place to be. Well, ah, damn. Those bubbles hit at the perfect wrong time. Pop potion, just keep going. Okay. Damn it. Okay, you need to die. There we go. Alright, so now I have to decide whether or not I want to try and fight those, and I'd probably say no, fuck that noise. At which point, now here I am, having to fight it. Fucking Megamon. I don't want to be here. I'm going back this way. Oh, god damn. Well, that was just a misclick. Alright. Now to test this room. And the fact that they come from two different directions, I can't just 
like AoE them to death immediately. Also, I don't want to be fighting in that fire, so I'm going to be moving away. Ugh, they run away from you so fast, too. Okay, that got a few of them. Oh, and it dropped some health. Nice. And I just pulled two more groups. Or one more big group, I guess. And I have to admit, this is actually very annoying for a room. Oop, I need that. Okay. And now over here, which I realize, oh fuck, I need to push this direction. If I push this direction, it's not so bad. Except these guys still hit hard. And they're being healed. I didn't realize he was on healer. Which is pretty annoying. Oh fuck. I unintentionally used a really cheesy tactic. Though on Rezzer this would be really annoying, I can tell you that. And it is very quiet because of all the uh, dead things. We have to slowly take out all these guys. That was unintentional, because sometimes I just run towards things. Can I just, like, stunlock the fuck out of you? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, I need to pick a target and kill it. There he goes. Alright, kill by a snotter. I can out DPS you, motherfucker. Just give me a minute. Fuck you. You're screwed now. Come back here. There we are. So uh, that room didn't get tested properly. Alright, so I see those guys. Do these take so long to explode now that you can just run straight? No, no, you can't. So I would want to probably go this way. It's not slowing me down as much as I'd hoped. Okay, it's slowing me down a little bit. And then I still gotta fight them anyways. Oh fuck, I shot it. Uh, so many sticky... Alright, we're going this way. Oh wow, I didn't think it was going to get caught by that. Well, that's not what I wanted. Man, bear traps are stupid. <sighs> Alright, considering how undergeared I am in this area... Or for this level. Okay, I need to not go fight that. And this really limits the fighting area here. Hang on, I want to get killed so I can fight this guy at full health. Come on, fire, hurt me. There we go. I actually took effort to die. Here we go. And I've pulled. No, use this. Why am I not... Oh, I'm pushing the wrong goddamn buttons again. Wow. A Jimbo killed the fuck out of me. Alright, let's go back over here. Uh. Alright, I'm just gonna pull this too. Oh wait, I want these. Yeah, this is scary. Oh my god, so many of those freaking... Yeah, okay, I'm happy with that. I need to change that one room. Yes, leave. Because I didn't realize that... 
this guy was set to heal instead of res. Huh. Alright, so now we just gotta wait for the uh, attacks to start coming in. Um, if you've been playing the game, you've probably noticed that attacks are coming in slower than normal since a couple patches ago. Uh, I don't know why a lot of people just aren't playing as much as they used to. Um, the game needs more content and more cool stuff and more monsters and all that stuff, and it's just taking a long time. Um, so I think some people are getting a little bored. And I can't believe how annoying this fucking room was right here. But, uh, with these guys <laughs> rezzing, hopefully it'll be nice. Uh, I'm afraid that pushing this direction is a problem, which makes me want to put another fire thing here or something. Um, or more mobs here somewhere. Yep, before we leave, we're going to try a thing. We're going to move this. Get rid of it. Um, we are going to try and do something here. Where don't we need guys? This really wasn't that big of a thing. This was bigger of a thing than I thought it was going to be. I just need some guys. So we're going to take... Oh, we need to fix this too. You are not in a good place, little guy. Um... We can afford to move some stuff around here. Let's get rid of you. Move you back and over here, maybe? These are right next to each other, so that's not working. I just want a little bit of space here. That should work. I want to move this back. Move you back here. Put you there again. You. Oop, not you. You. No. Trying to grab that guy. Need to not be right in the line of sight. That should just touch that corner. Which means you'll still pull this, but... You know. Okay. Let me think here. What else needs to be fixed real quick? Uh, we got four points. You're useless. You're going away. A few more points saved. And get rid of one of these guys. And then we're going to put a bunch right here if I can. Just some snotters. Just need a little group right here if I can. I might have to move some stuff around, but that's fine. Um, this guy can be moved over here, technically. And I don't think anyone will be the wiser because they'll probably end up being pulled in the middle. If they go that direction, well then they can probably one-hit them, but, you know, fuck it. If they do, and they pull this guy this way, just as good. Um, we're gonna move... Oh, not quite that far. I guess I can't really move him too far. Nah, I need to keep him where he was. Let's move you back best I can do there, and snotters. Damn, this is not going to work out the way I wanted. I wanted to put a handful of snotters right here, just in case they did pull that direction, or push that direction. I guess I could put a few here. It's probably not going to have the same effect. Let's move this back a little ways. Move these guys back a touch. 
So if they go and go, oh nope, that's uh, that's good. Grab a couple more. Can I really just barely not touch those two together? Let's try inching. Man, that's tough. Let's do this differently. And this is not working now. Basically we need a wall, whoops, not you. You. No, not you. We need to make sure that they pull, no matter what. At the same time, we need to make sure... We need to have some mobs down here in case shit goes south. And now these guys are too close. Eh, I just can't get it. I wanted to put some mobs here, just to prevent them from, uh, in case they push like I did, they've got some stuff to be annoying. So yeah, I'm going to call that an episode, we're going to wait for some replays, it was a longer episode, and uh, with any luck, we'll get some awesome replays.